but we put this display together and it's kind of like a club that it's a pretty exclusive club. I think I've talked about this before. Where uh, if you're brave enough or stupid enough <laughs> to, uh, to have met this challenge, it's an incredibly ugly, cool car. An unbelievably bad kit. And so I had to scratch build a lot of things as these other guys did, and I'm not going to steal their thunder, but this is my first attempt at putting parts on a car that didn't come in a kit. And I can say with confidence that whoever designed this kit never built the damn thing after they designed it. Because it, I, I, it's just phenomenally bad. But it's a cool car, and it's a cool display. So I'm part of the club. I get a little emotional sometimes talking about it. But <laughs> a little reclaimed. <laughs> a little reclaimed. Talk amongst yourselves. So that was a lot of fun. I'm glad. But the problem is the price of ownership now of this is getting a little steep because these cars on eBay go for 50, 60 bucks. Yeah. For a really crappy kit, you got to really want it bad. And <laughs> it's not the car so much. I think it's the club, the membership of the club. So. You have a newsletter? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we we do, Nick. We just can't get anybody to write anything for us. <laughs> so that's that.